Welcome back to Bloom. It's a new year and a new opportunity to improve your life. One of those may be your mindset. And joining us to talk about a new year and a new mindset is Dr. June Hall. Welcome to Bloom, Dr. Hall. It's so good to see you. Thank you. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. Happy New Year. And I see that you have a pretty cool display where you're going to show us about whether our, our glass is half full, half empty, or maybe exactly. the water inside's dirty, like you said. Exactly. <laughs> so, uh, you know, people say the glass is half full, and that means that's, oh, that's good. However, the glass could be half full, but it could be dirty. So, you know, it doesn't matter if the glass is half full, if it's not a clear, and we're relating this to our mindset, if our mindset is cluttered. So if the glass is half full with clutter, no good. All right. So this is a new year. And as you, you know, remember things last year were not that great. And it was a lot of people that are bringing that negativity into the new year. So we want to help by straining that out. Okay. So we will start here and we strain out some of that negativity. So as you can see, there is still mulky, mm -hmm. but it's not as smoky. Yeah. And you know why we still have some of that? Because things happen, you know, right. it's life. You know, last year, some people lost loved ones. There was unemployment. Mm -hmm. So of course, we're still gonna have that with us. And so that is a part of our mindset. However, as we're moving forward, we wanna try to remember some of the good things that are still happening, things that we take for granted, like, an opportunity like you and I are able to conversate. Some right. people aren't able to conversate. A uh, roof over our head, still being able to get up. So even though we still have some of those things that we brought with us that were stressful, mm -hmm. we are still working on straining those out. So as we go to the next one, we strain it a little bit more. But not only do we strain it, guess what we do? What? We add to it. We add good to it. Okay. So as we add more clear water, the mulky water also becomes clearer. I see. You see that? Ah, oh, a lot clearer. A lot clearer. So now we're filling our mind with something that is good. You know, positive thoughts, things that are happening that are improving. We're moving to a new year with hope. And a lot of times we give up hope. So we have to have that hope of opportunities that are going to occur in a new year. We should start reminding ourselves of that. And what we can do, just take a completely empty glass like this. It's not mulky at all. No. We can start fresh. Yes, we can. And so every time we think of something positive, we can add it in there. You know, I have loved ones still in my life. So we pour a little bit of that in there. I have an opportunity to try something new. Maybe I did have unemployment, but I have an opportunity to learn a new skill, to refresh my mind. And we know when we refresh our mind and start learning, that wars off degenerative brain disorders such as Alzheimer's and dementia. Mm -hmm. So we're like, you know what? I have that opportunity. Let me add to that. So with it's, every opportunity, yes, you're we're pouring a little, our glass. And, and you can drink that water with a lot of gratitude. Yes. What if we see ourselves starting to fall back into the murky glasses again? When we start seeing ourselves falling back into the murky glass, we have to remember this. Every day is not going to be perfect. <laughs> okay, mm -hmm. it's just called life. We're going to have hassles. You, you and I talked about earlier traffic. Of course, that's a hassle. So we're going to have things that happen. People get sick. We might get sick ourselves. Every day is not going to be perfect. So don't allow yourself to become so inundated with that negative because something bad happened. And you have to remember, okay, you know what? This is not the best day, but there are more days to, to come. come. Let Let's me keep on that pouring the water. Our clear and glass. You're going to help us face 2021 with some positive thoughts. You have yes. a new calendar out. I created, and you know, this was a last minute thought. It was in December, and a friend of mine said, you know, it's December. It's a little late for a calendar. But I said yeah. I'm going Never to do it anyway. And so this, every week, it has a positive statement in there. Okay. So, for example, this one says, maybe I dropped the ball, but I can pick it up and go for the end goal. I so love it. So every week, you, you read something. Something new. Your week I like that. That this beautiful word there. Well, Dr. June, you can visit her on YouTube. Her channel is youtubeaptacious.com. Thank you so much, Dr. June. It's Thank always so, so much, much fun to see you. And we're going to be back with more blooms. Stick around.